Hello and welcome. Today I'll talk about what's the current best way of getting tier 6 materials in Guild Wars 2 in 2021. First of all, let me tell you that always are still viable. After two expansions and a dozen of event maps saying doing meta events are not worth it would be ridiculous. Dragonfall and Drizzlewood might be the maps I would suggest you do. In Dragonfall, there are currently 24 hour key and chess farms going on by an old guild of mine you could join. But other than these maps, hot maps such as Tangled Dads, Auric Basin might also be worth doing because these maps are older, people are used to mechanics, events do not fail, and also finishes in shorter time they used to in the past. Second old method is buying them with laurels. If you do not need ascended rings, the best thing to spend your laurels would be buying heavy material boxes. No but they don't drop too many materials, just so you know. The two ways I used to get my tier 6 materials and I strongly advise you to use the same method is that getting trophy boxes with raid currency and map currencies. Get your Bureau Marches daily chests and buy Mistborn mods with them. Do one Dragonfall meta event per day and consume those Mistborn mods you get. With the volatile magic you get, you should be able to get 6 to 10 chests per day. These trophy boxes are sold by every volatile magic vendor in every map that came with the last expansion. It definitely doesn't matter which vendor you choose to buy these boxes. There is even a vendor in Eye of the North you can buy these trophy boxes. These trophy boxes are definitely worth paying one gold for them, as you can see from the amount of material I get. These volatile magic used to be the way to get money, because people would buy leather boxes and sell the leather, but leather prices dropped because of these boxes, so I don't know if it's still worth it. There is a second method to buy these trophy boxes, which is raid currency. Some people keep these raid currencies to buy infusions and sell them later to get money out of it. But I don't think it's as effective as buying these boxes, because those infusions you buy with raid currency costs around 2k currency. But with 2k currency, you could get nearly enough tier 6 materials to craft a full set of legendary armor. So. These trophy boxes are my main routes to get tier 6 at the moment, but there's also PvP and World vs. World tracks that gives materials if you are planning to spend your time on them. You can also do dragon response missions and get faction chests. These chests maybe do not drop that much tier 6 materials, but they drop good amount of crafting materials which you can turn to money. This will be my tip for the day. In this video I tried opening every box such as trophy boxes and heavy material bags you can get tier 6 materials with, so you can see amount of materials they drop. Thank you and see you later.